Thrive can have different meanings for different people, and the first ever TEDx at Bemidji was centered around that theme. Haiti Clotter shows us how Bemidji is thriving. Really just his upbringing. For Luke Upgren, TEDx Bemidji was the first TED Talk he attended, really and he was excited to hear unique perspectives on topics affecting people of all ages. It gives everyone a chance to see where some of these people come from, what we're kind of doing as a community, and um, and some of that some of that energy just coming to the forefront of the discussion. I think is really cool for young people and old people. It was a sold out event at the historic Chief Theater for the inaugural TEDx Bemidji. TEDx is a locally organized TED Talk event. The purpose of TEDx Bemidji is for people to engage with one another and spark up a conversation about different subjects. It's about things that they might not talk about every day. I hope that they take a new idea or they glean a different thought or they look and reframe their thought process on a subject that they maybe had a different opinion about in the past. Six speakers from the community had conversations ranging from deep topics such as race relations to lighter topics focused on clothing. Anton Troyer shared his story about issues facing Native Americans and how to overcome them. It's one of the most pressing issues of our time and I wanted to talk about something that was personal as well as professional and so it seemed the best way to bridge all the passions and points of interest. This year's theme was Thrive and anyone watching or at the event was encouraged to finish the sentence, Bemidji Thrives win. Jordan Heller scores goals for the Bemidji Beavers. When we all lean in. Welcoming competition and cultural events are some of the reasons Bemidji Thrives, according to attendees. There were live viewing parties at Bemidji State University and the Rail River Folk School. But we're taking Bemidji to a global level because everyone in the world will have access to what's happening here in Bemidji. What a great way to make our community thrive by making it available to people all over the world. In Bemidji, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. The chalkboard that was at the theater showcasing when Bemidji Thrives will make its way throughout the city with stops at BSU's American Indian Resource Center and the Headwaters Science Center. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.